Notice how the birds and animals pay attention to the environment. They do not destroy what supports them. Yet the literalized, overeducated masses take for granted what supports them and go about using poisonous pesticides and lethal 5G harmful Wi-Fi microwaves and whatever else unaware human farm people can come up with to destroy the planet. This is not an easy place and the system has already been created. So for the most part, people have to go along with it. The reason everyone is here is to recognize the bigger part of life. Your role really is about you waking up and recognizing what's going on in this world and the true reality life is. But this is a decision you make. Life is. The world is set into what it has decided. The best you can do is get along and figure out your part with this and how you in some way can become involved and step up and support those who are really doing something. It's getting down on the playing field. Do you just want to be a spectator and watch the game? Or do you want to get involved? What makes sense? The birds make sense. But people don't pay attention to the birds. The birds' lifestyle makes sense. It's about real survival, real value, real purpose, and a real position. Get your neighbors together and help save the planet. Through years of soil degradation due to chemtrails, poor soil practices, and overgrazing, much of the planet has turned into a barren desert landscape. But with creative management, we can transform it back into a lush, thriving ecosystem. It is possible to rehabilitate large-scale ecosystems. Solutions to fix major ecosystems remains reasonably simple. If enough people decide to wake up, something meaningful can begin to take place. We are living on the earth, and it makes sense that you should know what is really taking place here with the all-natural environment that supports you. We can create ways to enhance and support what supports all of us on this planet Earth. Given enough time, every ecosystem ends up like a forest. This is the end point of ecological succession, a point where the ecosystem becomes stable or self-perpetuating as a climax community and without any major disturbances. The forest will endure indefinitely. People can accelerate the process dramatically by simply altering the landscape, which has been done in areas such as the Los Plateau in China and the Desert Project in Jordan. First comes real food, real air, and real water. The most precious resource all of us have 
on this planet Earth is the rainforests and all the trees and plants that provide what we need to survive. We want to stay focused on doing something extremely wonderful for the all-natural environment, supporting all of us. And at the same time, we have a huge challenge, as there are those all over this planet Earth who are intentionally destroying what supports us. We strongly suggest that everyone take the time to investigate the real causes of the worldwide fires and other natural disasters that have been purposely planned to control the unaware public who should have rights, not restrictions, to everything on this planet. For those who have the awareness to see what is actually taking place here with the all-natural devastation which is also purposely planned by the world controllers, you now have the real opportunity to step up and do something with those who also care about your planet Earth. Dwayne Lee Hepner has created the nation's united universal university, which completely entails the all-natural environment everywhere, and a real education that has real value and that far surpasses any commonly created indoctrinating educational system that does not focus on what sustains all of us naturally. Real survival makes sense with everything here, that is self-sustaining. We see it makes sense to create rainforests with an abundance of food-producing plants and trees for people and animals to survive and thrive. Thank you for listening to this video. If you want to know more, contact USA Dean Val and UK Kevin Smith on Facebook and YouTube or through the website provided in the links. Dwayne the Great Writer dot net